everybody, welcome back to Katie's Nature Club. Oh no, like the bird feeder has been empty. I'm just going to give it to mummy now. We went out for that, mummy. Oh yeah, they've been hungry little birds, haven't they? Yeah. And do you know who like these nuts the best? Who? Our great tits. Yeah. Should we fill it up for them? Yeah. And do you know what else is happening at the moment with the birds? What? They're starting to nest. They're going to be laying their eggs soon because it's nearly spring. Shall we look at their nest? Yeah, so we've found a nest in our garden that we're going to have a look at. And also, what else could we do to help the birds other than feed them? Uh, make their nest. Exactly, so we're going to make them a nesting box today. That's yeah. fun, isn't it? Yeah. Do you want to come and help us? Okay, <laughs> me too. Come on then. Oh, yeah. yeah, so this was a nest from last year that our Robin built. We saw him building it, didn't we, Hayley? Yeah. But he never actually nested in it because lockdown happened. And what did we spend our whole time doing in lockdown? Gardening. Gardening and bouncing on the trampoline and making yeah. lots of noise. So he made his nest, poor little Robin, put all the effort in. You can see it's all, what's it made out of, Hobie? Uh, grass. Grass and... Leaves. Leaves and look, fluff, probably yeah. from our hoover that he's found flying around. And buffy fur. Yeah, so there was no eggs so in there. So we're going to make a bird box and what we're going to use is a pot, a terracotta yeah. pot with a hole in it. Okay, yeah. and we're going to use some ply board. You yes. are going to need some tools for this activity if you're going to make the same one as us. Well, but you can always just buy a bird box online or from a garden centre and put that up for your birds in your garden. But we're going to try and do our own today. Well, so, what you need to do, Hobie, is on this piece of wood, this bowl fits yeah. perfectly in here. And okay, what so do we I'll, need this for? Well, you're going to draw around. All the way around, mm. have you got a line? Line. Well it's done. a bit bumpy there. That's okay, because we're going to cut just on the outside so it wedges into our pot, okay? Yeah. This is stopping, we're going to put a hole in the middle so the bird can get in. Yeah. Alright, so we're going to cut it. Now we have to use a saw, which is quite noisy. I don't like saws. Okay. okay. I have done it a bit too big because it yeah. was my first time doing it. So now yeah. we're going to sand it down with a bit of paper. Yeah. On the sandpaper. It's coming out. I think so. All the edges as well. Oh, well done. Yeah, that's good. Scrub it around the edges so all the flow is out. It's nice and clean for them. So the best thing to do about mm -hmm. making your birdhouse, Hobie, is what? to work out what birds are in your garden. Yeah. So it's a good idea to sit and have a watch of what's going on to your feeders, mm -hmm. and then to work out what size hole you need, it's good to go onto the RSPB yeah. website and yeah. to, they can tell you exactly what yeah. size hole you need. So yeah. we know that yeah. we've got lots of what birds? Uh, blue tits, grey tits. Great tits, yeah. So we get more grey tits black than blue tits. tits. <laughs> we do get a cold tit and a black cap, don't we? Yeah. But we're going to do this for the great tit, which means we need a and hole. And a pigeon. Yeah, but and he's a, too big. And a fat pigeon. <laughs> 28 millimetres for our great tits. But like I say, have a look on RSPB website and they'll tell you what size you need for your birds. Oh. For our birds to have a nice nest, Hobes, the hole can't be in the middle because they'd only have that much space for their nest. So what we're going to do is do it near the top of our Ooh. circle. So I'm going to mark a spot about here for the top of our circle. Yeah, really? I know, that? yeah, I'm going to use that. that. Never used this before either. I'm trying all new things today, aren't I? Yeah. So, here we go. Noise. Whoa! Whoa! Look at our hole! That's cool. What do we need to do to that now, Hobes? Put this guy in there. We need to sand it again, don't we? Because oh, yeah. otherwise oh, the birdie's going to get Look, splintered. Oh. Do you want to use it? Do you want to have a go? chucking it down now. It's chucking it down, isn't it? Oh, me! Sand it down now. 
Yeah, but it's chucking it down. So should we yeah. go inside and decorate it? Yes. Yeah, come on, let's go make it look pretty. Okay. I finished our top of our bird house. Now we're gonna put it on with the hay inside. So we're gonna yeah. fasten it to the wall using this bit of metal that we found in the garage. You can just use a piece of wood if that's all you have. And we've drilled a hole in the wall and we're just going to screw it from the hole in the pot mm. into the wall. And then we're gonna put some nice hay inside for the not all of can, it, just a little bit that? to start them off. Eat that. No, do you want to try some? No. <laughs> and then we're going to put the lid on top, ready for our birdies to make a nest. So I put the screw right into the centre of the raw plug. I'm just screwing it now into the wall. Remember not to do it too tight because you don't want the pot to break because it is ceramic. But it does need to be nice and secure, which I think that is now. And remember, you do need to have it slightly high enough so that the cats and things can't get the birdies once they start nesting. They also need to have a clear entry and exit so that they can see if there's any predators outside waiting for them. So, Hobes, are you going to come and put the hay in? Do you want to grab the hay first? There you go. So we're giving him a little bit of hay just for a starter. Whoa. So that there's something in there to make it a bit cosy, isn't there, Hobie? Yeah. Okay. And, and then you're going to pop the lid on. Well done. Yeah. That looks good. So we'll just make sure it's secure so it's not going to pop out when they. Secure. 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 How does it look, Hobie? Oh, that's good. It looks really nice, doesn't it? Yeah. So it's, remember, it's National Bird Box Week. Enjoy yeah. it. Do something for the birdies just yeah. before they start nesting. Yeah. And remember to like our videos if you want to see more of Hobie's Nature Club and remember to have fun in nature, love to nature, bye! That's a funny bird noise, who's that making that noise? Who is it? Hobie! It's not Hobie, it's me, Birdie! <laughs> Birdie in a bird box? Yeah! <laughs>